the rim. The counter punch. All right, back like we never left because we never did leave. You got your boy Love on the Hate One and your boy EBTV Sports in the building. Back at y'all with another radio call. You already know we're finna cook. And I got an interesting topic between Clarissa Shields and Savannah Marshall in the UFC. I'm hearing rumors that they're talking about it. It's a decent money fight. And it's interesting. Like I just said, um, I'm going to let you guys know this. Um... Clarissa Shields and Savannah Marshall, they're like frenemies, I call it. Like, they're enemies slash friends. I know that sounds weird, but that's basically what that's basically what it is when it comes down to those two. Kind of interesting EBT to me is the fact that they can play us all and just get a big check and just go in there and not trying to really do much to each other. But... One part of my brain says that. The other part says, you know what? They're both too competitive. And I really feel like Savannah Marshall probably really feel like she can beat Clarissa Shields and she might have the advantage. Think about it. Um, Clarissa Shields is coming off a loss in the UFC. Savannah Marshall is coming off a W. A stoppage too. And Savannah Marshall hits harder than Clarissa Shields. So think about it damn in the UFC shit, that girl Clarissa Shields might be in trouble. Cause it's like you could really use your full knuckle to a T. I know they wear gloves but but very thin ass gloves. What what are they? One ounces for Christ's sake? Definitely, definitely thin. The, the thin as a motherfucker. Basically all fucking knuckle. So if Clarissa Shields take that fight, that would be interesting. It shows you the courage. But that's actually a big money fight to me. Because it's like everybody's going to tune into that. It's it's really interesting if you think about it. Like, come on now. That's an interesting fight. Um, But if the fight did happen, um, I think Clarissa would lose that, bro. I really feel like nobody can't fuck with Clarissa in that square circle. But... And the octagon is a different story. It's like the same thing if Mayweather fought, mm, let's say maybe Manny Pacquiao in the fucking octagon right now. On the ring, in the ring, I might favor Floyd all day, but in the octagon, I don't know. Maybe Pacquiao strong guys to get him. <laughs> but I'm just saying though, man. Um, I like that fight though, man. I think it's interesting, and I might favor. Savannah Marshall. What's your quick thoughts on that, though? Hey, I, I would have Clarissa win that fight, bro. Ooh, god damn. Even, even with all the rules, everything on the line now? Yeah, man. Clarissa from, well, you know, she from, what, Flint, Michigan or something like that. And, uh, you know, not that it has anything to do with my analysis, but she built different, man. And, and I seen uh, Savannah Marshall last fight against that Vargas girl. I mean... Come on, bro. Really? I mean, Clarissa lost her last fight, though. You you got me taking up for you got me taking up for Savannah Marshall, man. God damn, BT, look at you. The Vargas girl, you know, she looked all right. You know, um, you know, she she, she can kick all right, but she cannot box to save her life. Yeah, but we ain't talking about boxing. That's a problem. Oh, no, you we definitely oh, we talking about boxing more than ever, in my opinion, bro. Because it, MMA is is. Is like boxing on steroids, bro. Yeah, you got type of gloves. No kind of type of gloves like you got on boxing, man. Well, I think it said boxing on steroids, y'all. Are you hearing? It's, most definitely. It's, it, it's the worst. It, if, if you want to fight, <laughs> would you rather fight Mike Tyson in the boxing ring or in the MMA cage? Like a prime Mike Tyson. In the boxing ring, in the but boxing ring, bro. in the boxing ring, but keep in mind. I don't know how to do all that ground fighting and submitting and kicking, elbowing, all that extra shit. But both of them don't. Both of them don't. They two boxers trying to figure that out. They both you know, it's not like That's a good point. Hey, you you, you you got me there. Some type of rear naked choke or nothing like that. You you got me there. You got me there. But in my opinion, okay, this is a part. This is the part where I kind of got you though. The UFC gonna favor the power puncher though. 
you right. You right. You know what I'm saying? I think the defense is going to play a factor in there, too. You know. Ah, uh, you're going to get hit in the you you going to get hit in the UFC. Fuck all that shit. Yeah. But Vargas, this Vargas girl, man. All I'm saying is, you see Vargas versus Savannah Marshall. You switch Vargas out with Clarissa Seals. It's a totally different fight. And I think she's going to get Savannah Marshall, man. Clarissa Seals, you know, she, she won her last fight. It's February 20th. Not in the UFC. Not in the UFC. She's in. She did. She did not win the UFC. No, nah, she beat that DeSantis girl. Hold on. No, nah, hold on. Hold on. She, yeah, she did. Let me check. Clarissa Shields. She lost her last fight in the UFC. Hold on. She she two and one. She is. She two and one. Uh, I must have missed that last fight. Yeah, she two and one, bro. And she fought Whoever that girl is. Oh, okay, yeah, damn. Damn, that was damn. Hey, w- where did they have that fight at? At, at McDonald's? <laughs> Shit. Somewhere. I, you know, ain't really too much about it, but. Goddamn. She's showing the, she showing the hell did have a, a a win after that L. She had to um get that win back. I thought she was coming off a loss, but okay, good point. Yeah, you know, she got experience on the ground game with DeSantis. You know, uh, DeSantis had, a, had her in the arm bar for a little bit. She had to get out of that. You know, she had some some ground experience. She was letting her hands go, you know. And, you know, she was not swinging with nice intentions, man. So, you know, I see. Hey, what you... Hey, hey, fighting against Vargas. That's all nice and good, but that's not Chris Shields. Chris Shields got more power than that girl. She can box. She got a good head movement, you know. And, you know, this is... MMA is, is all encompassing. Like I said, boxing on steroids, but it's also, you know, you got some some wrestling in there. You know, we don't know. I think who's the strongest out of them, you know. But I just think Christian Seals' heart and that grit, I think she's going to whoop. She's going to she, she not whoop. She's going to be Savannah Marshall, bro. Um, you know, it's like I said, it's no no pattern on gloves. You know, Savannah Marshall do have a slight size of it, but it's not as, as big as it was with Vargas. Like, you know. It's gonna be um, it's gonna be a good fight, but most definitely gonna be a good fight. But um, I think he might. Savannah Marshall still got more experience than Savannah Marshall in the MMA too. Not that it matters because both of them are inexperienced like crazy. But, yeah, uh, but no, it do matter. It do matter. It do matter because if the fight just so happen, <laughs> if the fight just so happen to go to the ground, you know, you. I mean, I feel like, you know. Clarissa Shields gonna be more poised, you know. That do matter a little bit because, yeah. you know, it, I mean, Clarissa Shields had three fights, you know. So, yeah. But I feel like Savannah Marshall. Um, I mean, I mean, she she can't box like a Clarissa Shields, but she she's alright though. Like even in her last fight against Clarissa Shields. She didn't just get dominated. I had well, she got dominated. I would say Clarissa won like a good eight to four. You know, Savannah Marshall had her moments. She just she just lost the fight, of course. So yeah, I don't anticipate this being uh, that bad of a fight for Chris Shields. And you understand, you know, Chris Shields also, you know, the way she was fighting her past opponents, she was coming at them throwing haymakers and stuff. But she's gonna respect Savannah Marshall's ability more than she and her power was. too. Savannah yeah. Marshall do got some pop, man. Yeah, and she's going to have a general respect. So, you know, like them last fighters that Chris Seuss was fighting, you know, she, like I said, she was just coming forward and throwing punches and not really caring about defense. But she knows Savannah Marshall is a real boxer, so she's going to be her P's and Q's. It's going to be just like the boxing fight was. She's going to be on her defense. She's going to be a little bit more technical because she knows she fights Savannah Marshall, you know. So, um, you know, I think it's going to be a repeat of the boxing match. Um and I think uh, it's gonna, of course it's going to get the MMA feel because it's MMA because she's serious man she, she's just too gritty she's too gritty she's too tough man I think it's Chris Seals fight just by a little bit but you know it's just Chris Seals fight man alright for sure you know I don't want to make this a long video we're, we're already 10 minutes in you know um that's that's a good take um you made some good points um yes, yeah you know, she, she got Savannah Marshall hurt that one time, and it's MMA. Like 
you know, you get a startle. You, you, you can keep punching your head, but you can also near in the, in the nose, bro. Like, it can go real bad for Savannah Marshall. So, like, you know, I'm just saying Hey, I'm just saying the same things in turn, man. You know, uh, she hurt her. She got different ways to finish her off and shit like that, too. But I got, Cl listen, I, I got Clarissa Shields beating um, Savannah Marshall any day of the week in, in boxing. But I feel like MMA, I just, I'm edging. I'm not going to say clearly. I'm, I'm just edging Savannah. And I know, listen, you guys, I know you guys might kill me in the comment section. Like, love when you tripping. Man, I'm just saying, man. You know, I feel like. Um, she got more benefits and um you know the UFC. And not only that, um, even though it's only one fight, it's only one person that's undefeated right now when it comes down to these two in the UFC. <laughs> yeah, I guess. I guess you can't argue with that one. Yeah. <laughs> it is what it is. Good take though, you you cooked on that one. <laughs>